So today in this video, I'm gonna be showcasing all of the official iPhone 15 Pro cases um, from the silicone to the fine woven. I made a video on this, but that was before when the iPhone 15 officially released. But now we have all, all of the iPhone 15 colors here. And don't worry, this is completely soft, so I'm not scratching the screen. So we have the titanium black, the blue, the natural, and the white just to show you guys all the color variations. Now I'm gonna have chapters on this video to showcase what color you have. So for instance, the black, I'm gonna have a chapter for that, the blue, the natural, and the white. And I'm actually gonna open up the silicone cases for the very first time. Okay, so we're gonna start things off with the clay case. Okay, inside the box, nothing too crazy. Yeah, there you go. So depending on what color case you have, it's gonna animate that color, which is a nice attention to details. Of course, you have all your buttons here, your action button, your volume up and down, your side button, and of course you have your type C on the bottom. Can't believe I'm saying that for an iPhone. But just taking a look at the clay, if you have the black iPhone 15 Pro, this is gonna be a pretty cool combination, both dark colors. So you're gonna be able to have a nice flow. And to be honest, the black color is gonna pretty much look good for most cases. Now this orange one, I think this is gonna look kinda wild on the black, but it's just not my cup of tea. Like a bright color with a dark phone could work, but not really my style too much. I really would say it's good for the summertime, but now we get into the fall. Okay, and the orange, here's how the front looks like. You can definitely see it around the frame, around the borders of the phone, as Apple call it. And of course, it's easy to take off these cases too. You don't have to fight with it too much. And let's see how this Pacific Blue is gonna look like. I think this is gonna be an awesome color. But seeing how it look on the black, of course you have that animation, and voila. So if you didn't get the blue iPhone and you always wanted one, the man for the iPhone 15 Pro is pretty insane right now. So if I hold it over side by side, it's almost one to one. It's not exact, but you could pretty much get the same effect. Not really, but. It feels really good in the hands, I must say. Okay, so we have the guava case. So this is like a hot pink. Or maybe like a, I call this maybe like a tongue, <laughs> a tongue pink, something like that. But let's see how it looks. Yeah, we were supposed to get a red iPhone, but put yourself, you know, get a nice red case and you have the same effect. Not really, but you guys know what I'm saying. So this is how the guava looks like with the black titanium. You can get an idea on how this looks like. Always love green accessories. And we got that green 13 Pro. That was one of the best iPhone colors. And if you wanna mimic that same, that same thing. So black and green, or this forest green is gonna go one to one. Of course you have your side button there if I'm up and down covered, speaker grills, even how the frame of the phone looks like. Nice, I like how everything just blends in. Really nice. Now, unfortunately, I didn't get the MagSafe this time around, but I do wanna get one for me. If you guys wanna see a video on that, let me know. But a lot of people don't like the MagSafe wallet. They just don't trust it. So that's why I don't bother to even get it. So this pink one, this is really gonna look nice with that pink iPhone 15, but we focus in on the pros. But if you wanted a pink phone, get yourself a nice pink case. Now, this light pink and this black camo module, it's not gonna be the best color combination, but it doesn't look terrible. It's just something that's gonna look so much better. Like if you get the white, the white is gonna look one-to-one -one with this white, uh, with the light pink, I mean. But yeah, this is a little too bright for my liking, but it's still a pretty clean color. And let's see how the winter blue is gonna look like. Okay. So this one here is, comparing that to the Pacific blue, it's just darker. All right, let's slap it on here. And right away, I would like the Pacific Blue better with the black, but that's just me. But seeing how the um, the winter blue 
looks like it's still a nice color your action button is going to work just fine in this case i have the do not disturb but, and really just to test it out i have my magsafe wallet which is all chewed up this is the leather wallet rp to the apple leather magsafe okay and last but not least on the silicone side we have black now goes without saying the black is going to look best for the black iphone and yeah a nice all black case you can't go wrong with it and it's just for someone who wants to be low key and you have a protection this is going to be the one for you okay so now time for the fine woven case and kicking things off with the evergreen and i already unboxed all of these i just put them back in the box and if you put that on you have your nice magsafe animation and i love the way how this case feels in the hands but like I said in the previous video, on the case video, the durability, <laughs> the durability concerns is a, it's kind of questionable. But color combination with the black and the evergreen color looks awesome. And of course, your buttons are covered, your action button is covered, and they're nice and clicky too. I must add. Of course, your Type C and your speaker grills are open. But just to hold it in your hands, it feels very, very comfortable. Way comfortable than the silicone. But some would even say the silicones are more durable. And of course, my leather MagSafe wallet is going to fit there perfectly. So, yeah, letting that color sink in. See how the taupe color is going to look like. And I think this is my favorite fine woven case color. And I can't wait to see how this is gonna look with the natural titanium. And voila. So taupe is gonna look dope with the black for sure. All right, next we have mulberry. Now I must say, the fine woven cases are more of this darker color. So the black phone is gonna just look the best. But love the suede material. And yeah, that's how this is gonna look like. Okay, let's see how the black one is gonna look like, last but not least. And to be honest, I'd rather the black silicone case is just more of a darker color. And I forgot to try on the blue. Now the blue and the black, it's not really my best color combination, but for others, it might work. It might work really well. That is the black titanium. Let's move on to the blue titanium. So, gotta slap on all these cases on again. Now, if you guys are skipping around, it is time for the titanium blue on all of these color cases from Apple. Okay, so kicking things off again with the clay. So, here's how the blue titanium is gonna look like with the clay. And this is a funky color combination. The blue and the clay just doesn't really mix well, but you guys be the judge if you like it. Of course, your volume up and down buttons are covered. Your action button is covered, but nice little click to it. It's not hard to, it's not too difficult to press. Of course, your side button is there too as well. And you have your cutout for your type C and as well as precise cutouts to the speaker grill. And even looking how it looks on the front, you can kind of see the clayness, the clay color kind of bleeding onto the borders of the phone. Okay, moving on to the orange. Let me move this up a little bit. The orange and the blue. Could be a good combination, but the blue is so dark, in fact, that some light angles, in certain lighting conditions, this can come off as a black phone. But you guys be the judge on how it looks. It's all up to you. It's your decision. If you like it, that's all that matters. But me personally, I would not rock out with the orange with the titanium blue. Now time for the Pacific blue. Now this is going to be one to one. This is the color to get if you have the blue titanium, and yes, matches perfectly as expected. This is for sure. I would, I would get this in a heartbeat. <laughs> well, I already have it. You guys know. It's my favorite so far. Okay, all the corners, a little bit of lip protection, but nothing too rugged. It's just to change the color of your phone and having that Apple logo. Let's move on to the Gava, or the Grava. So this is going to be funky yet again. And I don't even know what color this will even look best on. 
but only time will tell once I get to those appropriate colors. But this is how it looks with the blue titanium guava. All right, so let's move on to the green. I forgot the name of this already. The Cypress. So a Cypress green with the titanium blue. And yeah, this is, yeah. Green and blue, it goes together, but not this blue. This is too much of a dark blue, but it's not bad, but it's not my favorite. I'm working on a wallpaper pack, so if you guys want to get my wallpaper pack, I'll throw it in the description if it's out already. But yeah, shameless plug, but I had to. You would think blue and pink would go together, but not this blue. This is too much of a light pink, and this is too much of a dark blue. So, and like I said, these lighter colors can show every little thing, so just keep that in mind. I want to see how this light pink is going to look like with the pink iPhone 15 because I do have that here. Now, it's not going to fit properly, of course, but this is the one to get. If you have the regular 15 and the light pink, you got to get the pink. Well, the pink and pink is always going to be one to one. So I just had to do that. All right. So the winter blue, this is another excellent color combination that you just can't go wrong with. The lighter blue is going to complement with the darker blue very well. Kind of give you that monochromatic look. Or just really, I guess you could say unity. And last but not least, we got to see how the black one is going to look like. And pretty much, this is like going all black. Very similar to the black color. Can't go wrong with this one. And since it's, the blue is such a dark color, you can get away with this case. Let's test out the fine woven cases. And I'm actually gonna kick things off with the black color. Fine woven, you have this nice texture, this nice back feeling. And that kind of correlate with the color. Like I said, silicone, fine woven, it makes a big difference going between the two. Let's see how the Melberry looks like with the blue. A bit of a funky color. I would not go with this one, but you be you be you make the decision. You decide. All right. Let's see how the taupe is gonna look like. I almost forgot the name of this case. Got mixed up with it with clay, but oh, almost dialing nine one one. But taupe with the blue. The green, I forgot the name of these colors already. Um, it's not the side press. What's the name of this? That's gonna that's gonna kill me. Oh yeah, this is popping. All right, so you have the blue in the blue. Yeah, this is nice. Just looks one to one, and Apple makes colors for certain phones. So yeah, this is stunning. A color like this would look nice with the blue, the titanium blue, or even the other colors like natural titanium or even white. But the black, it would look good too. All right, so now time for the white, which honestly, this white is going to look pretty good. If you couldn't get the natural titanium, the white one is going to be a friend. And for most cases, this is going to look really nice. The white iPhone with a case is going to look the best. And kicking things off with the clay. Oh yeah, oh yeah, now we talking. So somehow it just makes the case stand out a lot more better. It's really just thanks to those camera modules on the back. Um, everything else is pretty much exactly the same. Um, but when you look at the phone from the front, you have the frame, okay, or the border as Apple call it. You can kind of still see the color around it. Of course you have your bottom up and down button, your action button, and of course you have your side button, nice and clicky too. Of course, the bottom, you have your precision or your precise cutouts to the speaker grill, USB Type-C. Can't believe I'm saying that for an iPhone. And yeah, the clay looks absolutely gorgeous on the silver or white titanium, I should say. There's no stainless steel around the camera modules no more. It's all titanium. So even the camera rings around it is titanium opposed to stainless steel. All right, let's move on to the orange. And this is going to be another color that's going to just look like French kiss because it just goes hand in hand. Now the Pacific blue is also gonna look good. 
that darker color with the lighter camera module it's gonna look good but i would still say the blue titanium is gonna look the best let's see how the guava is gonna look like no surprise it's also gonna look good all right next up we have the side press oh this green i i really do love this case especially with the white i want to see how the natural titanium is going to look with this one of course you got that okay it's got the border kind of see the color a little bit but this is beautiful all right moving on we have the light pink and i would say this is going to be the best color for this that light pink is going to just look jaw dropping even with natural titanium you can get away with it but having completely white it's gonna just complement the best and like i mentioned it's gonna pick up a lot of lint or maybe a lot of dirt so really take good care of the these cases especially the lighter colors because i think these will look these will age very quickly if you're not taking good care of it. But yeah, really nice. All right, Pacific Blue. Or I'm sorry, the Winter Blue. And I'd rather the Pacific Blue better. But once again, it's going to look pretty good. black and white it's gonna look and of course time to test out the fine woven cases and kicking things off with the taupe yeah the taupe in the white oh that was a little harsh the taupe in the white yes this is probably my favorite color combination so far all right let's take a look at the melberry i actually got this oh can't in my mind to mention that all right, on to the Melberry. And yeah, definitely looking like fine wine. All right, let's see how the blue one is going to look like. Fine woven. Yeah, blue and the white. Another one. Hashtag another one. Somehow it snugs to the MagSafe wallet a little bit better, but not necessarily the wallet. Um, of course your MagSafe is going to work perfectly fine even though I still have the older MagSafe the leather it's kind of all chewed up going to probably end up getting another one sooner than later so now we have this green and white and green another good color that is basically it for the white now we are on to the titanium. Now, this is the color that I think most people are probably going to have. And we're going to start things off with the clay. And the clay and the titanium, yes, you guessed it, perfect. Like, perfect. Definitely one of the best color combinations by far. And, yeah, the clay and the titanium, the natural titanium is definitely really, really clean. And, of course, you have your frame. You can kind of see it, but it's a darker color. Of course, you have buttons are covered, but they're nice and clicky. And the reason why I'm keep on repeating it is for people who skip forward to the video. Your action button is covered, nice and clicky. Side button, your speaker grills precisely cut with the USB Type C on the bottom open, and it really feels nice on the hand. But really, this design is definitely one of a kind. Now the orange and the titanium. It's going to look good, but not as good as the white. I'm going to be honest, but it still looks good. This kind of reminds me of gold, RIP to the gold iPhones. I think this natural titanium is a nice substitution, but because certain lighting conditions, it kind of looks gold, but in certain lighting conditions, it looks silver. So, and moving on to the Pacific blue, the Pacific blue and the natural titanium. Yeah, this is going to be another one. Another one for the books. Most cases are going to look good with the white and the natural titanium just because of that lighter neutral color. 
All right, on to the guava. Now the guava and the natural titanium, also good. I'm gonna stop saying natural titanium. You guys get the color already. This is the natural titanium portion. Definitely wanna be careful with the, the lighter colors because it will show dirt wear and tear a little bit more easier compared to the darker colors. Um, and even with the darker colors, you just gotta treat the silicone cases with care because typically these cases really don't last too long. But looking at the green one, yeah, this is money right here. This is definitely money. But the side press is definitely a nice color. Especially with the titanium. Something about green and titanium, just it just looks good every single time. The light pink. And honestly, the white one looks the best. But definitely you can get away with it with the white too as well. But it's not my favorite. I like the white one better than maybe even like the, the black one. I like the white one better, but this is a close second. This is definitely a close second. And it looks just as good. And next up, we have the winter blue. By the way, if you guys are enjoying this video, make sure you guys thumbs up the video. All these color combinations for you guys to decide. And the winter blue, another color that looks good. Now, black, it's going to look good on all the phones that you get, but just to show you guys how it look anyway. All right, moving on to the fine woven cases, we have the taupe. Let me put this on correctly. Yes. Yes, sir. -y. Natural titanium with that taupe. Perfect. Perfect. Good. But I'd rather the clay silicone but i like the way this feels man let's see how the blue one come on blue speak to me affirmative yes i'm so hungry right now i need a little snack but the blue pretty nice so the melberry aye aye captain yeah, so this one here, the titanium with the melberry, this is a nice color combo. Kind of actually blown away how good it looks. Kind of give you that champagne, that champagne look. Kind of like you in a celebration, you know? All right, so here's how the green one is going to look. And just like all the other cases, really nice. Of course, you have your cutouts on the bottom, your buttons, and a button on the side, covered. And last but not least, we have the black, the good old black. Can't go wrong with this one. And I think this is, and I think that covers it all. All of the iPhone 15 Pro colors with the official Apple cases. All right, let me know down in the comments down below. Currently, I'm transferring all my data to my 15 Pro Max, one terabyte to start this day in the life. But let me know down in the comments down below what's the best color combination in your opinion. And make sure you guys drop a like on this video, guys, because this took me a lot of time and I'm continuing to make more iPhone 15 content. So make sure you guys click on that subscribe button with notifications on. And other than that, I hope you all have a simple day. Peace.